Camurri advises two new units for the production of handcrafted beer, Camurri Mastro Gourmet and Camurri Brower. The model Camurri's Mastro Gourmet is equipped by the special Bemery system, where the indirect heating permits a light and delicate boiling of the product. The model Camurri Brower, equipped by a unique container with direct heating, permits a tumultuous boiling. First of all, let's prepare all necessary ingredients to produce your beer, shown in our instruction book, or following your favorite recipe. Before switching on the units, please follow these simple instructions. The model Master Gourmet is equipped by a special Bemery system, which must be loaded connecting the unit to the water supply with a free-fourth connection by the faucet identified as upload and check the water quantity inserted into the water glass, which must join the marked signal. In the Master Gourmet unit, please remind to let the superior faucet open in order to permit the steam spill. This operation is not required for the model Camurri Brower. Put inside the Monstro Gourmet and Camurri Brower the requested water for the production. On the container you can find five notches, which indicate 30, 40, 50, 60, 70 liters. Once filled up the container, insert the filter and the mixer. Switch on the unit with the switch on PLC, which will turn on the PLC before programmed, as shown in the section How to program the PLC. How to program your receipts with our programming PLC which will permit you to have four programs with four steps each. Now let's see how to program a basic receipt. Insert the key on PLC. Press A or B to set the receipt. Once selection the receipt to use, press OK. Proceed setting the temperatures and the times, helping you with the regulation keys plus or minus. Once the desired value has been joined, press OK. With the key minus, move on the right column and press OK to set the time in second expressed. Press again OK to confirm the time. Proceed in the same way to set the next steps. When the water will join the desired temperature, insert the malt before grounded with the grinder in its filter inside the units. The mixer will mix homogeneously the malt, making easier the sugar instructions and will permit the homogeneous distribution of the temperature inside the container. The machine will pass automatically from the first to the second step, called the mesh out.
and at the end of this phase the switch heating element will light automatically, signing the starting boiling phase. At the end of the working step, you can proceed with the spurring filtration step, obtaining a limpid wort. Light off the mixer switch, remove the mixer and lift the internal filter, inserting in the central part the appropriate support, blocking it in its place and proceed with the trash rinsing with some boiling water. These steps allow to get back the extracted sugar. Once sand it is phased, at once the trashes will be compact inside the filter, this part will be then removed from the unit. Joining 98 degrees, the boiling step will start, light by the step work switch. During this phase, you can check the word sterilization, a partial evaporation of the liquid before calculated, and then replenished with the trash rising. The boiling step will be lighted by the step work switch. During this phase, you can check the word sterilization, a partial evaporation of the liquid before calculated and then replenished with the trash rising. During this phase, you can add the hop, inserted into its filter, as explained in the receipt, where it will give off all its organolytic substances. At the end of the step, the light switch will end to flash, indicating the end of the boiling time. Then you can mix the wort clockwise in order to obtain the whirlpool process which helps to the release the substances during hopper process and to filtration remains to fall in the back central part of the container. Once ended, once ended this phase, you can proceed with the cooling down, which can be realized with the Master Gourmet, linking it to the water supply of the upload and download BEMRE faucets, where cold water will enter and exit with a continuous flow, or, as happened in the Kamuri Brower, you can proceed with the cooling down with the cooling plate implantation or with a knitting coil with the water supply. Once cooled the wort, you can extract the central faucet and put in it in a ferment unit, where it will stay till the addition of yeast and then the bottling step.